Welcome. We're so glad that you are here with us today for exploring EXP. And I've got Gusty here. And uh, Gusty, I hope you've had a great week. Um, looking forward to exploring a little more about EXP today with you. And he must not be. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm going to jump right in. It looks like he froze up. Yeah, he 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 took himself out. He'll pop, pop right back in in a minute. So I love technology, right? You never know what you're gonna get, and right. uh, <laughs> always <laughs> real and raw. So he'll pop back in in just a minute. And uh, so I'll, I'm gonna go ahead and. Um, you know, introduce our awesome guest. Um, we love these ladies. I adore them so much. And uh, I want to first welcome Kristen. Kristen, hey, you're here. Yes. <laughs> and In my angelic sense. Like I, I, we were talking about earlier, I said, I look so pasty. <laughs> I, love the, I love the angelic look. You know, uh -huh. you're always looking for ways to stand out, and you even did it with lighting. <laughs> That's right. That's right. <laughs> so, so glad that you're here. And uh, Kathy Murphy, welcome, uh, welcome to Exploring EXP. So, thank you. I finally made it on. So. <laughs> <laughs> great. Always and an adventure. Both of you are in Prattville, Alabama, and um, y'all are just having such a great year this year. Yes, we are. It's a very good year. It's 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 good to have. Um, I always say I thrive in positivity and people that are kind of like minded. So I'm sure that a lot of that has to do when you're happy, you can do great things, you know. And so I, I tend to thrive in a positive environment and I love um, the encouragement that we get and the people that we surround ourselves with. And so I know that that has a lot to do with um, just your drive in general. And, and just also, you know, Kathy and I always talk about we, we want to provide a good service to people and a good experience. And so when you're happy, great things can happen. So you can better create those experiences. Yes, so, correct. Yeah. And you've always closed, Kristen, just a high volume business. And uh, tell us a little bit about, you know, your background, you know, your history in this business, because, I mean, you're you're one of the very top and have been in the travel market. Well, um, uh, I originally actually was going to go to law school. I don't know if you knew that or not, but um, I graduated from University of Alabama, Roll Tide, um, in 2001. And so my original goal was get, to go to law school, actually. Um, and so I worked in a few law offices and we had about 12 acres of land to sell. And uh, a friend of mine was in real estate. So I had talked to her a little bit. But um, at the closing, when I was a part of the transaction, um, I realized that I was a people person and that I really enjoyed the whole experience of everything. And so um, 15 years later, I'm, I'm selling real estate. So um, started, you know, with a brokerage that uh, was a big brand, um, had a really good foundation um, of uh, basically we had a wonderful extensive training program. Um, and, and so we had to go through all of the people in that brokerage. And I remember I had certain things, uh, kind of like our onboarding checklist of things that I had to do. And, um, two or three months later, I just, I knew that I wanted a really good foundation and whatever I did, I'm real big on education, learning different things, learning different ways of doing things. So um, you are. I, mean, I love that the two of y'all drove to Birmingham to take CE with me. Mm -hmm. and so much fun. And you also turned it into a girl's trip by having, you know, a spa at Ross. Yes. Bridge. You got to have fun terrible. if you're going to do, do, do education. <laughs> Definitely. Make it fun. So that's one thing I like about our core values because I'm naturally a fun person anyway. I like to do fun things. And so. That was one thing that attracted me to EXP as well when I started kind of diving into the core values and 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 I'm always up for learning something new. So 
Um, and of course, I guess yeah. and I both love that too, because we love to have, you know, over the top fun and, you know, and, and include everybody in on that too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, and it just so happened that um, Evan had been talking to me about this awesome new company and um, I put him, I'll be honest, I'm a little embarrassed because I put him off for a few months. <laughs> because I said, Evan, I, I'm I'm just so busy. I, I just don't have time to take a whole day um, to do this. And um, and he told me, he said, I really. And so he continued to tell me about, you know, certain functions and things. And so finally, you know, I, my my schedule it was so strange. My whole schedule cleared um, for that day. And I got to meet you guys. And so. Kind of the rest is history. And of course, I asked Kathy if she would like to, to hear about it. That It was a, um, a new company and a new way of doing things. And, and I like what I hear so far. So I invited her. And so here we are five months later. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> you know, it has been a crazy five months, too, right? Uh -huh. Join the world mm -hmm. up. <laughs> It really did weeks. I mean, just a couple weeks after we joined, really, at, when we were doing our CEs, it was right after that. Yeah, where really, because we I was up. sick teaching. And yeah, you were sick, and I was sitting right beside you. So. <laughs> <laughs> I was a little nervous for a few days. I, know. I was so nervous. <laughs> I immediately went and got it tested, and you know, because all I could think of is I'm going to affect all these people. But at the end, when we met, um, and, and Kathy, you and I, we we've known each other. So um, yeah, yeah, and you're one of the reasons. I mean, you know this that it's Kristen asked me to go, you know, to Auburn. Uh, and I was just, I was kind of like, oh, I don't know, I'm kind of busy this week. And she was like, well, Jenny and Gusty are going to be there. And I was like, okay, I'll go with you. So, um, <laughs> and I mean, you guys do great presentations. You're masters at that. So it definitely, I remember Chris and I getting back in the car and we were just like, wow, you know, wow. So, and we, we made our, our decision pretty quickly that we were ready to really did. jump on board. We really did. We did. And and I told her, I said, listen, um, you know, uh, you know, of course we went at this really nice restaurant that Evan told us about. <laughs> and after that. And uh, we just kind of discussed everything and we were like, hey, if we're gonna do this, we're gonna jump all in. How about it? You wanna do it together? And she she said, and so, you know, I mean we did. And that's kind of and we always say that our timing was absolutely perfect for us yeah. and for our businesses and um, and what's going on right now, you know, the virtual sales meetings and getting to do this and feeling like we're sitting right next to you guys and we're connected through this and we still, but we're, we're still together here when we need to be, but we still feel like we have, we're surrounded by, by a great support system. And that's, that's important to me and to feel connected. And, and I just, I love all the resources that we have available to us and, and the, the classes. Um, I'm real big on education. Love but if, if I have, um, which is very rare a day that, you know, I can just sit here and, and I can, let's say I want to learn about buyers today or sellers or whatever. Um, and I love the classes that EXP also came out during this, this time of selling real estate, you know, um, for COVID-19, um, ways that you can do things. And, um, you know, um, it, it, it's just, it's perfect. It was right up my alley. So, and, and, and it's just amazing. So, well, you, um, what, what your production is what normally what around a hundred? Transaction. Oh, not that high. I wish, but <laughs> hey, it's a goal. It's a goal. I normally sell, um, depending on my year, um, pretty much between 40 and 60, 70 houses a year. Okay. So, yeah. Um, and, uh, you know, Kathy's working her way up to that. And yes. You know, Gusty and his team close <laughs> over 400. Um, I'm doing everything I can to, to kill myself and close over 60 this year, or, you know, close to 60 and ah. something in our classes for each one of us. 
That's right. Um, because at a traditional brokerage, Gusty couldn't get fed. You mm-hmm. know, he couldn't go and learn from people around the country that, you know, he, he can go into our virtual world and learn systems and processes from people who have uh, teams that have expanded across the country that are selling mm-hmm. elements. And, um, you know, I can go in there and get fed to learn, OK, better ways to be working. And so that I can turn, you know, wherever I'm going to end up between 40 and 60 to, to 80. And uh-huh. you can take your 60 and learn mm-hmm. from someone to push up to 80. And, you know, Kathy has already and I'm going to brag on you and I know I'm going to embarrass you. <laughs> You know, Kathy has already earned more this year than she did all of last year by July. This with EXP. So that doesn't even count, you know, before, you know, January. So, yes, I'm so yeah. proud of her. She, um, I was nervous to make the jump. I mean, I was nervous and it's, it's just been um, really great and it feels good to, you know, it, those were my personal goals is to do better than the year before. And it's, I'm definitely, you know, at July, I'm already doing better than I did last year. So it's, it's exciting for me to just, um, you know, I have a competitive, I was in medical sales, pharmaceutical sales for 18 years. So I have definitely am, have a, am very competitive. Um, so I mm-hmm. definitely like seeing myself surpass. Um, and I'm not, waiting it's not december it's july so it, i'm i'm a happy person. i mean you're gonna end up really flying through i mean yeah i think i'll probably i hope to cap soon, i think for the next couple so i'll have right three or four in the board that might get me there so I like i'm hoping it's over with your whiteboard I do have a big whiteboard in there, and I'm like, I have, yep, I think it might happen. <laughs> and your average sales price has been higher. They have been um, higher. Since you've joined it's, the and It's been really good, and I've, um, you know, this is the year where I've been waiting on this moment where my referral base is starting to happen, um, and it's just, it's, and I, you guys are all y'all been in this forever and you know how that feels. But when you start having clients call and refer you, you're just like, yeah, I did it. I, I did what I wanted to do for my clients. Um, they're still happy with me. So <laughs> it's, um, and that means a lot because for me, you know, real estate is so much about the relationship and it's, it's a huge, huge purchase. And it's, um, it's, it's very important to me. And that's how I want to build my business is around those, you know, loving on your people and taking care of them. And, um, and I really do. I, I have some amazing friendships that have come from transactions. So um, I love been, that our network and our resources, like you called me about trying to get a house closed for someone who um, I did. lived in England. England, he had moved to England. <laughs> you were kind of there taking care of a pool, a house, all kinds of stuff. Putting on a new roof. Yeah, <laughs> not me personally. <laughs> well, and I love that we were able to share. I was like, I don't even know if our roofer will go to Prattville, but he did and worked it out. And like, we all got to meet each other at that CE event. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. And it was amazing how that worked because I was just like, I reached out to you and they, you know, I felt like you would know the answer. So I reached out to you <laughs> or you could come up with something. Um, and, you know, we just, it was sort of a beautiful thing where the right person, the right people were put in the right place. And I mean, it, it just worked out really well. Well, Kristen yeah. called with something this week also that, you know, she wasn't um, thrilled with and it really burned me up. Um, about what somebody's doing in the market and Gusty immediately went and handled it and took care of it for us. So mm-hmm. I love that we're kind of, we're just all in this together. And right. is your, is your mm-hmm. sound working? <laughs> I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Okay. <laughs> he said, back. We, we oh. all laugh. It'll work like right in the beginning and you know, <laughs> I mean, one thing I I do love about this is, you know, I'm newer to the industry than any of you guys, and I can pull from your experience, which I mean, I, 
I rely on Kristen a lot. I call you for things, but it's, it's good. I think that's one thing I really like about EXP. It's not just, you know, a little circle. It's a big circle of people. And it's, you know, somebody can, if you don't have the answers, we can find somebody who will, you know? So it, um, I really like that. And I think that's, you know, um, I think that's, one of the good things that you know definitely a good thing about the the company you just have so many people who are at the top of their game i can call and just say okay how would you do this and i get answers so it's 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 a good feeling for sure i know i stay crazy busy and we all do um so you know i want to help even more and sometimes i can't so i'm so glad that we have that kind of culture where you can reach out to lots of people um, even mm -hmm. these, if they don't get me, they call Chad or, you know, yeah. the, the, the yeah. they'll, you know, they'll hunt somebody down and, and everybody's happy to help as much as they can. So guess you Absolutely. can you hear me now? Yeah. We can hear you now. <laughs> so here's what I really think happened. I think my kids <laughs> messed up our Wi-Fi, So I'm like tethered to our, my cell phone. Um, and so like, as soon as we go live, I think like the, the Wi-Fi switch got turned off. By the <laughs> what happens? You get these crazy kids at the house. I know. Well, I'm glad that you're exploring oh. now, back exploring with us. Uh -huh. and, uh, we're, yeah. we're, we're exploring Prival right now, and uh, it's, yeah. it's good territory. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, yeah. And one of Very hot. Different. You, you want to hear something really funny? So yeah. um, when I was headed back here to do, to do this and kind of get ready, it's such a hot market that literally I was on the phone with a friend of mine and I, I said, there's somebody that's pinned me in my driveway. <laughs> like she's blocked my driveway. And I said, you might want to, you might want to stay on the phone with me. And so I walked down to the end of my driveway and this lady said, Hey, do you have anything for sale in this neighborhood? <laughs> I love it. You're like, no, but I can help you find, there is one in your neighborhood. Right? <laughs> she said, she said, um, I, you're not going to believe this market. And I said, well, actually I can. And she said, well, what do you mean? And I said, because I'm actually a realtor. <laughs> and I, just, I said, yes, ma'am. We are very low on inventory right now. And she said, I know I'm trying to find a house. So she said, would you take my name and number down? And she said, and just get in touch with my agent. She Aww. said, if some, and I said, so you have an agent? And she said, yes, I do. And I said, well, I tell you what, since I, I live here and I'm on the Facebook page, if anybody gives me a heads up, I'll get with your agent and let her know. But yes, Aww. she's in my driveway. <laughs> so that funny. tells you how low on inventory we are right now. I mean, we're just so... Um, I talked to a friend of mine the other day and, and she received nine offers on one of her listings. Wow. And it was just, it's, it's, you can literally have your clients and there are people waiting at the curb right. waiting to get in. I mean, it's, wow. it's so, it's so hot and it's just, uh, you know, that, you know, I always have been told there's several the top three things that sell houses, price, condition, location. So you get those right. And of course I've got another one and it's also the right agent that you choose. I was going to say there's so, many more. <laughs> yes, that's right. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so, um, but anyway, if you get those things right, it will go and, you know, and it'll sell quickly. And so um, my listings have been staying maybe 48 hours. There was one that um, just sold. Actually, I was hammering the sign. I didn't even get it in MLS. And so it's a very hot market. Um, Is that the one where I was hammering the sign? Oh, that's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, actually, Kristen. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You had to take pictures of that one. But you had hammered the sign and literally I got a call. <laughs> We um, help each other. That's the good thing about having a teamwork. buddy. <laughs> That's right. You were helping me that day. But, um, but yes, I mean it's 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 unbelievable um, how how active it is, and and that's another thing that we when we when we join this company together, not only do we have each other locally to help each other, 
because you never know, you know, when you're going to need somebody. And um, mm -hmm. we also we can reach out to you guys. We can reach out to, you know, um, of course, my, you know, Evan and Matt and, and just whoever. A matter of fact, I've, I've talked to Chad a few times um, because I got to meet him, Jenny, in your in your CE class. I really like him. He's, he's, he's pretty awesome. Yeah. And so <laughs> I talked to him and and I've I've talked to a lot of different people in different markets and it's just it everybody is just on the same playing field it's just like like collaboration and and everybody is just so willing to help and it's just such a great thing because i mean I, you know in real estate for 15 years sometimes at certain places you may not get that right you well know, you may you may not get that and and, and people are not you know, and, and it just this model suits me and 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 I like to help other people and and sometimes I need help. And so it's just nice to have the the good resources and and the help and, and plus it's fun and Kathy and I have fun. And so it's just it's it's an it's it's fun. Well, so. yeah, I think I had a question for you. Yeah. You know, earlier you were talking about um, and I could hear you, but I, you just couldn't hear me yeah. uh, earlier. You were talking about uh, when COVID hit, mm -hmm. uh, there was a lot of really um, spectacular training that came out. Yes. And, and what happened was a lot of uh, the top agents around the country said, hey, we want to give back to the company. We want to give back to the agents. We know that right now is an interesting time, you know, period. Mm -hmm. um, and so what we found was a lot of people came up with some really fantastic classes. And, mm -hmm. uh, you know, we were able to take advantage of that. And I will tell you, like, you know, what I have found over the last four or five months with this company is the training, like it was good but it mm -hmm. has gone to the next yeah. level. No, it's it did. Yeah. much better. I mean, last year I, th I heard, and I told Gusty this before he joined, he said our training needs to really be bumped up. And I mean, Curtis Dixon is amazing and he just is so passionate. And I just love everything he has done as a commitment to make sure that our training is off the charts. And yeah. it is, it, it is really, fun. it really is. I mean, coming from a, a super nerd here that, that goes anywhere I can, you know, to take classes. Um, I mean, I, I'll be honest with you. I have been, I've been so impressed and, and, and that was probably some of my problem in the beginning on the production because I could not get enough classes. I mean, I was just like, oh, what's available today? Oh my goodness. This is just great. And, oh, this instructor, I mean, he's, He's in Australia and he's going to be teaching us, you know, and I mean, it was just it's so amazing to to have all those different people with different they live in different states and, and even in different countries that you get to learn from in different. I've always been interested in different markets other than just mine, it, this one. And even when I travel, I'm the first person that will go. I don't know if y'all, but I, I love getting real estate books everywhere I go because I, I just I do the same. Yes. I, and, and I know that um, I you know, think you're coming a thing of the past. I mean, I, I know, I know, but I still have a little old school and they're tiny. <laughs> they are. I remember when, when I started in 2005, they were, really that's that was the thing and and now when i go places whether i go to the the coast or i go up north and that's like hey let's stop and get a real estate book you know <laughs> <laughs> so um but i love to study different things and that that was one thing that that i really um but also the way that I look at it is when I learn new things and whether an agent is new or whether it's an, an agent that may, it's a, it's always a good idea to learn something new. This business is always changing all aspects of it. Our company is so innovative and has been from, you know, its origination. And I feel like we have, um, first dibs to mm -hmm. new technology or new way of doing things. Um, I remember I went to EXP con before I joined uh, when it was in new Orleans and uh, from the stage, they were talking about how there was a new 
um, technology that you had locks on the doors that you could get a passcode in and somebody could show themselves or it Ubers out to the local, um, whoever is the closest real estate agent. If you're part of that service, that means it, just like Uber, you could be there within a few minutes. I mean, mm -hmm. you're talking, that's life changing. That's industry changing, consumer driven, industry changing technology. And guess what? I, EXP bought it. Um, mm -hmm. and, and they're developing it in certain markets right now. And it'll be available in our markets probably, you know, 10 years from now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and that and that's that's kind of what we were talking about, uh, Kathy and I. We always say that when we when we started, we could not have chosen a better time because, um, of course, COVID was kind of coming out, and 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 so when we started learning more about the business model and the way that it worked, and the way that um, you know you could do things like this, and and you know, but you still. A lot of people, I think, think that all we, that's the only way that we talk with each other is in the world and, and things like that. But we still felt connected um, through this whole thing. And also, when I was taking those classes, Dusty, that they offered um, the new classes to, to try to help and, and just kind of shed some light of some things that you can do, how to handle showings and things like that. It, um, you know, I had other agents reaching out to me saying, hey, how should we handle open houses? You know, how how are you handling showings? You know, what what have you heard? Um, maybe how to protect buyers, sellers, you know, in these different conditions, you know, that we're in instead of shuffling people from home to home to home. And I, I said, well, I can I can tell you what I'm you know, I've read a lot of forums. I've, I've taken some classes and let me tell you what I'm doing, you know, and they were like, yeah, yeah. I mean, that that really makes sense. And, and I like that. So and I like to help others, you know, and, and, and give back because I know very early on I had some great people in my life that, um, you know, took the time out of their busy. They were active and active agents in season, and they took time to invest in me, you know, so I feel that responsibility as well. Yeah. But well, yeah. you've, you've actually already uh, brought people into the company by mm -hmm. showing it and um, just yeah. like said that, you know, Kathy joined and Kaylin is a doll and Gusty and I got to meet her at, that was our very first lunch and learn that mm -hmm. um, we did. And then of course the world completely shut down after that. Yeah, I got to see Kaylin. Uh, I, I took a trip to visit her this weekend and I was there to see her write her first contract. So, um, that's awesome. And I got to see her potential first listing that's coming up. So I offered some advice and I got to see her area and she drove me around uh, to different places. And so I just had a really good time with her and we hadn't seen each other in a while, too. So it was great to see your friend after a while. And it's really neat to have. Um, something in common as well. So I just shared with her, you know, the whole weekend. I said, this is what I know. I'm willing to teach you what I know. So here you go. That's great. Oh, we're so sweet. She's going to be fantastic. So she is as pioneers in Prattville because, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. you know, EXP really probably was talked about but not a whole lot of people jumping on the bandwagon at the time. And, you know, you had to go to Auburn to really understand it. And Gusty and I, um, we went from Birmingham down to Auburn, who was already mm -hmm. met with pioneers with Matt and Evan. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and yeah. they understood it. And now you're bringing on our very first pioneer in Anniston, Oxford. So mm -hmm. I love how this company, you can reach out and help people come from everywhere. And mm -hmm. this business model, and you touched on that a minute ago. And as we're exploring EXP, um, that's one of the things you know. You, we can uh, share the company with anyone in the the, the U.S., Canada, um, uh, Australia, and um, the U.K. And we've got some other countries that are going to be coming along very soon. Yeah, so you can you can share it pretty much anywhere because it eventually it'll be fully. Right. Yeah. Countries. 
we're reaching out to countries right now that are not there trying to find out like who's going to be our, you know, first people there. So mm -hmm. that's and awesome. That's, that's, that's awesome. It's so, much awesome. so, you know, let's talk about the, uh, you know, what do you get by sharing with the company? What, you know, what rewards do you get? Because a lot of agents will, um, especially when you have influence, uh, uh, the brokers will use your name constantly and they'll use mm -hmm. it to recruit. And, you know, if you're lucky, you might get a lunch or a gift card. Um, <laughs> if that, right? That's right. If that. And then you'll have the privilege of having to train that person that <laughs> came because of your influence <laughs> and get nothing for it. Right. So, mm -hmm. um, you know, let's let's talk a little bit about that and, you know, how, how you see rev share and how we're you know all financially aligned um well i guess i can go first um the biggest thing for me was um i kind of you know in in, in the past i'll be honest i'm kind of embarrassed to admit this on video but i didn't have a cap i mean i i didn't i was i was so consumed in what I was doing and providing service and, and, and things like that. But it took me um, actually going on vacation out of the country and looking out at the ocean and figuring out where do I want to go from here? What do I what do I want for my business? Um, what what can where can I go? that would offer me great things, but in, in return, I can offer to my customers and my clients. And, but also I sat down and kind of, I'll be honest, put pen to paper um, of, of how much I was paying into that brokerage. Um, and it astounded me. It really did. I'm being completely honest. Um, well, and I could, people just don't take the time to do that because they think short term and it's, that it's about the split. And uh, you right. don't need to be embarrassed. My dad was my broker for my first five years. Mm -hmm. and that's kind of 50-50 split. I mean, that's just what was there. And that's all he knew for so many years. Yeah. So mm -hmm. so I had my assistant go back and, and actually do that for me to help me with that. And I it just, I was in shock because, you know, I have a 12-year-old and I'm thinking about future and I'm thinking about college and I'm thinking about um, you know, things that people in their 40s start doing. And I started thinking, my goodness, I, I could have put three kids through college, you know, right. and right. that was just huge, I guess, because I know that at 41, I'm still paying student loans. So <laughs> I guess it really hit home uh, in Roll Tide, Gusty, because I know you graduated. Roll from Tide. And I'm and still so, paying student loans, too. So. Yes. And so, I, you know, I started thinking because, like I said, originally I was going to go to law school. And so I had taken my LSAT and all that. Um, and I just and I started actually a master's. And so anyway, I mean, I've racked up some student debt and I started thinking about just the future and, and things. And I and I looked and I thought, wow. And so that's one thing that, you know, when you were up there explaining that, you know, where you can actually cap, you, you already started a higher split than most people. Because, right. hey, when I initially started in 05, I was at a 50-50 split. And it, you know, I mean, that 80% is, I mean. Right. And, and, and you know, and, and you start, but not only, here's my thing, but not only do you start at an 80-20 split, but you have a chance to get everything pretty much that you pay in back in a cap. Right. And other than some very minimal transaction, a transaction fee, but that's what blew me away. And um, I always get my advice in, as far as um, trading and things like that from my father. So, you know, the fact that I could actually, when you, and, and, and I, I hope this doesn't offend anybody, but you know, when you, Pay into certain brokerages, you don't get that back. No, you don't even have the opportunity. You, right, you don't have the opportunity. That is money that you will never see back. Would and then you, you would you mind sharing how much you paid into that brokerage? 
Um, I figured in um, over the last five years, it, it was it was in excess of over two hundred thousand dollars. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So, um, yeah, it 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 was very. Um, I just tell you about that, and I'm not being yeah. over dramatic here. I'm just you sat down to take the time to do that, and mm -hmm. when you think of over the last five years, and uh, I have to use my calculator because math is hard. I can only calculate. <laughs> of everything yeah um you know it was it and and but it was you know plus or minus that but 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 still that is a lot of money and you know and i and then you also have to think but it's not just if you take the money out completely take the money thing out completely and you've got to think okay for that amount of money how is this benefiting me in my business right okay what am I getting? That's what we're doing today. Yes, That's right. Now it's a hundred twenty thousand dollar raise, but what tools, systems, business model, culture? Correct. Yeah. Yes. How does what, that help you to even? What? 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 It, what? What am I getting back to pay in that kind of money that I will never see again? That will not go to my children. You know what? What am? What? What am I getting? And it came down to very few things because I was a seasoned agent um, that pretty much ran my own business. Um, and it and, and my thing is, it came down to, you know, what a few things. <laughs> and so when I when I started, like I said, I started comparing and I thought, wow, you know, not only do I have a chance to earn that back, but I have a chance to classes are amazing. Um, I love working at home. I want more of my time to be able to spend with my customers and clients versus, you know, just being hanging out in an office. You know, I get more, I would always get more done um, in my home office, you know, um, because that's just, um, where I worked better anyway. And I tell you another thing that is a huge plus to me is that having everything in one place instead of having a home office and an and one in a building, I I cannot tell you how many times I was like, okay, where's my lot boxes? Do I have some in my home office or do I have some at the office or Oh my goodness, I left that file from working on it earlier. Oh, yeah, that's the big thing. The file. We don't yes, have that anymore. Yes. We all all our file, files are digital. And uh I me, I love paper. I'm gonna roll in it. <laughs> yes, yes. Paperless. Paperless. And, and and I tell you another benefit to me, if I had a closing, you know, on like a Friday, um you know, and sometimes you're ready to get out of town. Sometimes you've got you've got plans yourself for the weekend. So I'd have to go back to that that company and then I would have to turn it all in and make copies and make sure everything's stacked up. And then I realized that, you know, I'd been there an hour and a half, two hours, and then I find other things to do. Now when I'm at closing, I can take a picture, upload everything I need. And it, I mean, it, it, it went from a two hour ordeal to a five minute thing. I mean, it, it was just, and, and I've always said that I'm looking to work smarter and I'm open to, to new, uh, establishing new systems that are, are, are easier and simpler, you know, simplify the process is what I always say. So I I've just seen, I could go on and on about the benefits of EXP. <laughs> So, Kathy, what do you feel like are some of the ones that you've really been, you know, surprised about? Like, um, it's a lot of the the same things that Kristen has talked about. I mean, I love the accessibility again to just great minds. Um, I really like the. Um, I mean, I, I echo so much of what she says. You know, we kind of fell in love with the same thing at the same time in terms of the company. Um, I mean, I like, I like, I feel great about the company and being able to, um, I mean, I, I love to align myself and market myself alongside EXP. I feel very proud because I know that it's a company um, 
you know, that it's exciting. And I think they, um, you know, there's just, there's so much that is offered. Um, you know, I think Chris and I both, we, there's so much that we want to take advantage of. And I think we still, we've just kind of gotten the tip of the iceberg because we've been so busy since we've started with the company. Um, you know, just to, there's even yesterday I can think I was like, Oh gosh, I want to, I want to take a listing sheet with me. And so I got on enterprise and I was like, well, there's one right there. And so, you know, I made it my own and I printed it out and I'm like, oh, that was, that was quick and easy. So just, I think the, uh, having access to so many things um, and then they keep adding on even, uh, you know, like bomb, I think what was the last thing, like maybe bomb bomb with that is integrated with KV core, things like that. So <laughs> it, um, you know, I just, I see, I think we're a company that's staying um, up with, innovation, new things. Um, and the great thing is about it is we as individual agents don't have to pay for every single one of those things. It comes with your you don't have to pay for copies. You don't have to pay for copies. <laughs> you um, pay for you know, like so I, agent, I think it's or she had a closet office, like seriously, a closet with bifold doors that mm -hmm. had no window, and it cost like seven hundred a month. <laughs> yeah. So, wow. Um, <laughs> <his face>. um, <laughs> to be honest, I mean, this has been a lot of parents. We've been home with our kids. You know, so I can I can still work and um, have my kids here. So I mean, that's been huge for me is still be able to fully function. Um, I mean, I've had several uh, clients who've been out of the country, and I've still I mean, it's just been practically seamless because I've just been able to function fully despite the distance and. Um, mm -hmm. So, I mean, I, I love the technology. I love, I feel like there's so much of it that's streamlined. I mean, you're always going to run into hiccups and things like that. But overall, it's, um, you know, pretty seamless. And again, it, it's sort of like, gosh, I wish I could find that. And then you just go on and it's usually there. So <laughs> and what you're talking about, if you're watching this, is our marketing center. We have um, all kinds of templates from buyer presentations, listing presentations, um, to agent attraction materials, stuff about the company. And you can just go and merge it super quickly and print it out. And it looks great. You can do uh, just sold uh, flyers or just sold postcards or just sold social media um, mm -hmm. <clears throat> marketing. And you don't have to think it up or hire a graphic designer. It just merges with um, your marketing promo. And uh, even it, it, they'll send it, they'll email us um, uh, uh, information, like, you know, promo for our listings whenever they go live. So um, as long as we do everything we need to do on our end. <laughs> <laughs> That's the important part. But, um, I mean, I've just been really happy. I, again, I came from a 18, 19 years of being in a professional, you know, pharmaceutical medical world. So this is familiar to me in the sense that it's, it's very professional and there's, um, you know, it, it's, again, I feel like I have access to so many people and great minds. And, um, and for me, you know, I, I think I've spent a couple of years in real estate where I really felt like I wasn't investing in my future, which scared me a lot because, you know, I'm sure you guys remember way back when, when you started in real estate, that there's a couple of years where you're feeling a little, you know, is how is this going to work out? So, I mean, for EXP, for me, even to look at what I've already um, have just in our stops, I mean, even even over just a few months, it's exciting for me to think, hey, there's something for my future here. It, I'm it, building that, like Kristen said, for my kids, for my family, for us. So maybe one day I can retire. So mm -hmm. it, um, you know, that part of it is is very exciting for me, and it's um, and I love the fact that our stock has grown despite, you know, having a difficult time in our in our world. And it's, it just, I think that's, um, 
that speaks a lot to the kind of company we are and how dedicated we are to it. So, and, you know, Gusty uses the term generational wealth and creating that because we can actually um, leave this to our children. We can leave this to, um, you know, a beneficiary. Um, our, our stocks are not, it, it doesn't just shut down uh, uh, when we do. <laughs> so, and in a short amount of time, because I've been here since the end of uh, December 2018, uh, you know, I have um, a lot of stock built up because some that I've purchased, a lot of it that I've been awarded. Um, what you were saying earlier, Kristen, I was able to get my cat back last year in stock. Everything I'm in the company came back to me uh, in mm -hmm. stock, except for those transaction fees. Um, and I'm about to hit that again. So, I mean, it's just such a wealth opportunity to take care of my family that no other company can take care of us like this. Um, and, but what I love even more Absolutely. what I want to share with you is that Chad hasn't even been with us 10 months and he has more stock than I do. And oh, wow. <laughs> he is. And so, I mean, like opportunity is so abundant with this company and we all have the chance to earn it. And it's not just for the privileged few, it's for everyone. We all have the right. same opportunity. And, uh, um, you know, Kristen, you've already attracted people into the company and um, you're going to be able to experience some of that soon. And Kathy, I've talked to people for you. And I mean, it's so good for agents um, because of these kind of benefits that you can't get anywhere else. Uh, we need to be sharing this and we need to make sure that they know about it because um, yesterday we had two agents, uh, new agents join us and they both got really snippy remarks from other agents at other companies about joining us. And I said, don't worry about them. They don't know what they don't know. Love right. them anyway. They haven't felt mm -hmm. need. They didn't sit down and write how much they've been paying their broker yet, Kristen. Mm -hmm. They haven't right. Paid. Right. They haven't felt the need to look elsewhere. But when they do, you can't say no to this business model. Timing might not be right, but mm -hmm. you can't say no to it. So our stock is now, uh, when I first started, it was at seven. What was it when you, Gusty? When you, um, you know, I think it was like right around the $10.50, $11 mark. And I just checked it. I mean, it went, it went over a little bit, uh, twenty one dollars today. I think oh, it, it was at eighteen just a couple of days ago. So wow, yeah, that is so <laughs> I mean, it's, it's pretty unreal. Um, and yeah. y'all you know, were talking about generational wealth, and I don't think people really understand. Like, you know, agents I think are notoriously some of the worst financial planners in the in in the world. <laughs> Well, how do you how do you think I felt when I sat there and figured all that out over the years of what I oh, paid yeah. I, what I paid in? I mean, <laughs> I mean, so not only I mean, like uh, we got people that don't even pay their taxes on time. I mean, we don't we don't we don't. <laughs> no, I paid them on time. <laughs> I mean, we're just so you know. Here the good the good thing is you do have the stocks that you can pay 5% of your commitments to mm -hmm. buy stock at a 10% discount. Well, you know, I, I think the average um, that I've invested in a lot of the stock is right around $8. Well, a lot of the, the, the investment has, you know, two and a half times that, which is fantastic. So, you know, I've, I've built up a, a stock portfolio of, of a very nice amount of money. And yes, that's something that I can give to my kids. But what people I don't really think understand is, you know, revenue share. And that's something that, you know, a lot of people, there is a lot of misnomers uh, of, of revenue share. People think it's profit share. People don't, I mean, there's just, there's a lot of um, inaccurate information. But what I can tell you is revenue share is real. Yes, it is. And, you know, I made a post yesterday. I know of people that paid, you know, just because they're talking about the company. I mean, think we're all four of us are, are owners of EXP yep. because it is on NASDAQ and we all invest in the company. We all get awards. So it's kind of like an employee stock, um, you know, a bonus for, for some of the stuff that we're working on. And, um, you know, people call us an MLM. Well, 
if we were an MLM, we wouldn't be able to be on NASDAQ. Yeah. So, you know, and, and, and so, you know, that's a lot, like a lot of people say, Oh, you're an MLM, blah, 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 whatever. You know, um, I, what I can tell you is this is changing the life of my family. Yes. And it's changing the life of a lot of families that I've aligned myself with. And so revenue share is willable. Revenue share, I'm going to say it again. Revenue share is willable. So I've got two boys under four. Um, and Trip and Max are going to be very well taken care of. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm going to be able to be debt free. Um, you know, I, I think I'm, I'm kind of charting my path out for that. So being able to be debt free within a couple of years is going to be pretty fantastic. I'm able to really start looking at my investment future and start really identifying bigger things that I never I, that I ever thought I could do. And so, you know, a lot of people just don't have they just don't plan. And so if you a get in the model. You're going to probably make more money if you're watching this. I am going to raise. Um, just, a, just a commission and compensation structure plan. Right. So you're going to make more money. B, you're going to have so many more training opportunities than you could ever imagine to help build your business. You're going to have opportunities at stock. And so you can truly start planning your future because I'm, I, I want, I'm 39. And I want to show houses at 50 because I want to show houses at 50, not because I have to show houses at 50. Mm -hmm. I'm truly planning <laughs> my future. And then revenue share. I, I, what I would get deposited in my account yesterday would blow most people's minds away. Yes. And so, you know, and, and I'm only 11 months into this company. And, um, and so people, um, I think you're in the business and we get, you know, just like you were saying earlier, Kristen, you know, I'm so busy selling houses. I don't even look at the business like mm -hmm. my business. And so, you know, I would encourage everybody. COVID has given the, the great opportunity for everybody to rethink everything. Right. They're rethinking their future. They're rethinking their plans. Do I need to stay in this house? Do I need to go somewhere else? Do I need to move closer to family? So COVID has brought some really good stuff that has made us really think about our futures. Mm -hmm. and so, you know, the people that are currently watching this and maybe watch the recorded version of this really need to think about what does their future look like? Mm -hmm. What does it look like? you've got to make a plan for your future and you've got to make a plan for your family. You got to make a, a plan for your kids. And I promise every single person that's watching this, if you would just take 30 minutes, take an hour, really look at the opportunities and not let anybody else tell you what this company does, your, your mind will change. I promise you because it is a game changer. It will eventually be the largest real estate brokerage uh, in the globe, in my opinion. And um, why not be a part of something that's growing and that can truly change people's lives. And, um, and I would just encourage people just to take a look at it. You don't have to tell anybody, take a look at it. Maybe have that conversation with Kathy, maybe have that conversation with Kristen in a very confidential setting. And they'll tell you it's making a difference in their life. Well, it's changing their business. Speaking of confidential, um, we don't tell people who we talk to because we have a lot of um, influential, heavy hitting people. We know what it could do to someone's business if the word got out. We, we will never mm -hmm. use somebody's name like that to um, say who we're talking to, to impress. Other brokers do it all the time. That is not our image. So I just wanted to make sure to say that. Um, we have a lot of people that reach out and it is very confidential. Um, nobody knew when we announced Chad Beasley that he was coming, nobody. <laughs> nobody knew. Um, and it, somebody got out with, with Gusty, but um, it wasn't because anybody at EXP said anything <laughs> so we um we we 
make sure to keep all of that stuff very confidential. Just wanted to add that to it because yeah. I mean, Kristen and Kathy, I mean, you're going to be turning heads. People are watching what you're doing in Prattville. They're going to say, wow, I mean, you really got to 100% so quickly. Um, Kristen, what does that feel like? I've never even been on 100% before. You know? it's, 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 it was amazing because, um, you know, at, at different larger franchise companies, um, you know, it was kind of in 2005, 2006, 2007. So, I mean, I saw all my friends get to do that, but I was a new agent and I learned very early on um, to treat people right, um, to do the right thing. And to, I, I, you know, Kathy and I talk about this all the time. Back when I started, I didn't want to rely upon huge um, lead gens. I just stuck it out. Um, you know, I just really worked my spear and just did everything I could do to get out there. No matter where I went, no matter who I met, I just told them about me. And, and, and I always say, just offer yourself and what, you know, what you can offer them of value and how you can help them. And so that's how I built my business. I, I never really, um, I did all those things. Like I know in that class, Chad was talking about postcards, um, how he is, you know, that was kind of what his, how he kind of started his business. I did the postcards. I did, you know, all of those things. And I'm still kind of old school in that way. But what's so neat about EXP is learning new ways to do things. So you have a little bit of old school, but then you have some new things that you can learn and implement that in your business. Um, and the other thing that I, so it's just, it's just amazing. And, and to know that, uh, you know, like I said, on top of just by being able to accomplish that, you know, in, in five months, actually, I almost did it in four, just to let you know, <laughs> but a couple of closings got pushed and I was like, darn, but, um, but I was, I, and that's when you texted me and I was like, well, I should have already, you know, and, and, and you said, well, it's probably coming Monday. So, um, but, but it, it's just, it's a great feeling. And when you go through something like that and, and the fact that you, you know, I always say when people reach out to you and say, good job. I mean, you've worked really hard. That's just, sometimes you just need to hear that. And it just kind of, you, you need that support. And a lot of people, other people, the top of the top, of the top they, don't, they don't get it. They're busy pouring mm -hmm. into other people and they don't get the good job I noticed. Like I sent a message to Natalie last night saying, hey, you did nine last month. And we can see all this on the dashboard, by the way, like, but, but whenever you cap, like I won't be able to keep up with like how much you've put in to, to icon. Um, yeah. So you've got to keep me posted on that. Okay. okay? <laughs> Every time you have a closing till you get to your 20, um, huh. I, I need to know, but okay. No way. I had nine. <laughs> She's so busy. <laughs> right? You know, she didn't even know. And, um, so it's just, I mean, we're all paying attention because we just want y'all to do so well. And uh, I want to do well, too. I want y'all to cheer me on, too. Um, uh, and uh, one last thing before we go. And when Gusty was talking about things that he heard this week about people saying about Rev Share and about how real it is, it is um, my first check was, I think, 350 somewhere. It was either 350 or 550. And I'm like, oh, my God, that'll be great. Well, you know, that's so cute. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> That's so awesome. And, you know, and, and Zach, Zach has two people that um, he's brought to the company, two people that oh, wow. I love, and he made $450 this month. I mean, that can change a life as well. Um, for me, I was able to pay um, an Auburn tuition payment, a Jacksonville State tuition payment. Um, I had money left over to pay for my Grand Canyon vacation, and I also paid all my household bills. And, wow. um, and I really still have some left over. I'm not kidding. And it's, um, short amount of time. Like I really, I do get emotional about this because where, where am I? I sell real estate. <laughs> where mm -hmm. I yeah. Yeah. Go to get that. That is all extra. So, so many blessings are coming to y'all and, uh, two of you just bless me every day. And, um, we're just so glad to be in business with you. 
Thank you. Well, we're, we're glad to be here. We're very excited about our future and we love that we have you guys uh, there, you know, whenever we need you in a support system. And um, we're just, we're just very excited. Here we are. Well, now we got to cheer and Kathy on to Kathy soon. And yes. Yes. Um, look at all these going to happen. Keep looking at my board. <laughs> there you go. And then yeah. send yeah. you on to Icon so that you can get all of your cat back in stock. And um, then again, I mean, you'll love the company even more as you take advantage of all the benefits it's got. So mm -hmm. um, and Gus and are still, we're, we're still learning and discovering new things about this company every day. And like you said, Kathy, they keep, you know, inventing new things to, to support us with as well. So um, we just thank you so much for being here. And if you're in you. practical or really, if you're anywhere, if, if, if uh, Kristen or Kathy touched you today and their story touched you, then, reach out to them and find out more in a confidential conversation. And Gusty and I, we're always here to, to talk to you and see what might be a good fit for you and your business, but do yourself a favor and simply explore EXP Realty. We thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Uh, thank you guys. See ya. Bye.